In order to get the most out of this video, you are highly recommended to watch my R B A D methodology videos in this channel first. Hello, welcome people to another session of Maths I Can Do with Teacher Kevin. Today, you will be watching a video conferencing lesson on the topic of numbers and algebra. So sit back, relax, and enjoy the lesson. Mr. Lee spent a total of $28.50 for some files, mm. rulers, and highlighters. Okay, files, rulers, and highlighter. Uh huh. You guys and girls, please recognize this type of question now, okay? Nah? Standard uh, procedure, okay? File, rulers, ah, Mr. Brian said, I must write in order, you know, you're confused, okay? And highlighters. Yeah? Okay. Okay, I'm not so nice. I need space here. So I moved here. And watch it up. Okay. So, yeah, he bought file rulers and highlighters, and all of them cost how much? Uh, $28. $28.50. Yeah, see? I uh, always start with like, uh, okay, actually why I do this is easier to understand. I'm not smart guy, seriously, I'm not. I take myself as a student, I sit there position. How to do? Read the question and try to understand and start with work with something. Uh. You know, right? Read everything. I guess this one, when you read everything, you become confused. Uh, you can try, but I'm not going to try. Thank you very much. Okay, continue. He bought twice as many highlighters as found. Hmm, highlighters, okay, okay, fine. Uh, highlighters bought twice as many. Okay, in terms of pieces, uh, pieces, uh, in terms of pieces, he bought twice. Aha, uh -huh. okay, in terms of pieces, he bought twice. That means files only got one. Uh. Agree or not, Rachel? Yes. Okay, you see how I do maths? I am not so smart one, seriously, what you do, I do. Okay, he bought twice as much highlighter as far. Okay, so if highlighter, what do I do? I call it a unit. A unit. And this must be unit. Okay, again? Okay, can you tell me in terms of pieces, uh, pieces, not money, uh, pieces, how many units he bought? This one, in terms of pieces, he bought how many units? Unit. Two units, lah, in terms of pieces, right? Unit is 10, then 20, lah, if you, right? This one is one unit, lah. Yes, no? Yes, no? Hello? Yeah. Yeah, that's all right. I mean, if you need this 100, then 100, then this is um, two times 100, but I don't know the unit. Can okay? okay, in terms of pieces, huh? okay, next, thank you. Each ruler costs 50 cents, and each file costs twice as many as much as each highlighter. Okay, there's the whole mouthful here. Okay, can I? Huh? So each ruler costs. So, do, do we know how many rulers you buy? We don't know, right? Yes, no. Yes, no. Don't know. Don't know how many pieces. Agree or not? See? That's what I do. Don't know. Yes, no. Okay? Yeah. But in terms of money, in terms of money now, whatever contribute to the total, I move this a little bit, whatever contribute to total must be come from pieces times money. Agree or not? Hey, whatever you buy times money, agree or not? It's one unit. Okay. Didn't throw it away. Times money, times what price, you know, at what price. Hello, you understand what I mean, at what price? No. That's how we calculate money, right? Unit times, okay, files, don't know. This one also don't know. Yes, this one also don't know, cannot. But what he say? Each file, can you read this useful, peaceful information for me? This file, and... Each file, cost yeah. price, estimate. As much as each highlighter. Even though I have uh, like just now gone through new, now you see I have to read again because no point one. Can see uh, each file costs twice as much. Okay, do we know the price? Each file costs twice as much as each highlighter. So which is the lower price? The highlighter or the files? Highlighter. Like no, okay. So I don't know the price, right? Okay, I say price low. Can you see price? At what price? I don't know. Yes, not. But in the, if if this guy is called price, okay, maybe I use a blue color, a bit darker. Okay. If this guy is called price, then what is the cost of the files? Read this. What's the cost of a file? 
if price is called P, what is the cost of the file? Each file costs thrice as much as the highlighter. What should be the price for the file? Okay, if the highlighter is called P, each file costs thrice. P. 3P, you see, Mr. Brian, this mess is improving because it's just read. Hey, we are like, read, read Mr. Brian. We are like dummies, right? We don't know what they say, what, what they say, it's just right home. You understand? Or? Just like, is it, oh, whoa, the files is one unit, the highlighter is two unit. That's right, oh. So this is price, right? If your price is P, this guy is 3P, yeah. Can or not? Understand, not? Miss, uh, oh. Miss Richard, you understand why he, I wrote price? I don't know the price. And, but whatever price, this guy is three times the price. Agree or not, Miss Rachel? Yeah. I'm not doing maths like, wow, well, you need to think like that, you need to think like that. I'm just following straightforward method. What you say, I do. I never pull magic, like magic shirt, never pull rabbit out of the head, then you're wondering where it come from. No. Okay? Now, if you have one piece times three times the price, what is the money that you pay? Ah, I need this. If you have one piece and you pay 3p what is the money that you pay one times one unit times three one u times three p is three unit times the price i don't know what it is not usual price unit times the price this one eh? if you understand that uh, is what uh, this, this one two, two two unit and the price uh, i don't know what they are Whatever unit times the price. Whatever unit. See, this question very bad. Unit don't know. Price also don't know. Can you see or not? Can you see or not? Yes. Yeah. yeah, very bad question, right? That's why I say, uh, well, if Lucas can do it, very good. Uh, his brain very good. Uh. Okay. So here, that means in terms of money, do you guys agree? Whatever unit, I times three times the price, I get three U times price. This one, two unit times the price, two U price. Okay. So far, so good. Everybody understand? Uh, yeah? One unit times three times the price is three UP. Two unit times the price, don't know. Both of you don't know. Two UP. Any problem so far? No. Okay, come. In that case, just now was you. You, you. But this is three UP, yeah? Can I draw you a picture then? Um, well, the price was three UP, yeah? Okay, let me see. The price was three UP. Oh, okay. So, well, in terms of box now, it's different, huh? So in terms of dollars, just now was pieces here, different one. This is the, um, that means if I were to draw this, okay, this, this will be three boxes, three UP, with the UP inside, okay? So let me shrink this, okay? Okay, that means this one, how many boxes should I draw? If this one is called uh, UP, you know, uh, the unit times the price, the unit, times the price, the unit times the price. Miss Richard, how many should I draw below? How many boxes should I draw below? How many should I draw below? Because there are three UP, is it? One UP, two UP, three UP. Can you not? Three UP, can you? Okay, I'll break up, I'll show you. Three UP, so one UP, two UP, three UP. Then two UP, how many should I draw below? Two. Mm. Two, la. two box, but I call it UP la, because you that means the unit times the price. That's all. I don't know. Can you see? La? They never give me. Okay? Uh, but then continue. Next one. Do you understand why I draw like that? That this was uh okay, I just to not to confuse you. This was what's the difference between this and this? This is just unit. Can you see? La? Whereas this one is unit times the price. Do you understand? Price, I don't know. I is P. Okay? But the price for highlighter is P. This is 3P. So one unit times 3P and 3, 3 UP. Uh, two unit times P, 2 UP. Now I draw the box. Uh, yeah. Undo. Undo, undo. Now I draw the box is 3 UP. Three boxes with UP, UP, UP inside and two boxes UP, UP. Okay, can? Okay, next statement. It's been. $4.50 more on the files than on the highlighters. Oh, thank you very much. Finally, I know what is U times P. What is U times P? You see the English? $4.50. Yeah, he spent 
This is what you spend on a file, three UP, 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 UP. This is what he spent on high, highlighter, two unit times P, two UP. And then because of that, he spent $4.50 on the file in the highlighter. Do you know that this is $4.50? Because that is unit, cannot compare. This is money you can compare. Agree or not? Hey guys and girls, do you understand what I'm talking about? Or not? Yeah. Yeah, so one of the UP is $4.50. Can you see it? Can you see it? That means one unit times the price. I don't need the unit. I don't need the price. Now he go and fake me by telling me one unit times the price is 450. Hey, uh -huh, uh -huh. Can you see uh, this? I never like skip anything. Uh. I've been explaining to you. Um, I mean, step after step, what they say. I never ask you to think deep, think shallow. No need to think what he said. Just do. One UP is 450. Do you understand? Hey, how many UP you got here? You got five UP here, can you see? No? You got five of these boxes here, no? Do you understand? You got five of these UP boxes here, no? Yes, no? Hello? For the files and the highlighter, he spent a total of five UP. Can you understand, no? So how much did he spent on the files and highlighter all together? Because five UP is the files, Plus the highlighter money. Do you understand, people? Yes? There's a rule of money here, no? Don't know, no? Can see, no? But for, with the files, you spend 3 UP, and the highlighter 2 UP, and 1 UP is 450. Do you guys and girls understand what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, so, you know what? Times 450, yeah, because 1 UP is 450. See? Very bad question. Never tell us unit, never tell us price. But tell us like that. Do you understand why I've now put 450 in one of the boxes here? Because it is here. The files spend 450 more. One more unit times the price. Understand what I'm trying to do? Miss Rachel, can you understand? Yes. Yes, so what is five of the 450? That means five times <laughs> now. Hello. Okay, what is five times? Okay, five times. Of course, you got better method. Like I tell you, go ahead and use your method. Huh? Mine is a silly method. What he say, I do only. I don't understand other methods. Or neither can I think very deep. No shallow. Okay? I just do what he say. What is this? Tell me. $22.50. Oh, $22.50. Hey, this is for the files and highlighter, no? $22.50, no? Then where is the difference come from? Must be from this joker ruler right yes or not hey must be from this ruler right yes or not get it or not i haven't settled a ruler no this is a ruler yes if the files and the highlighter cost five up and one up is 450 right five hundred twenty two fifty. what is the spice spent on the ruler come on 2850 minus 2250 agree or not agree or not yeah uh, what is the money what's the money six dollars Okay, six dollars, huh? Hey, so far, lost or understand? So far, if this is the money spent on ruler, hey, one ruler costs how much? Hey, just now never read for me, huh? Hey, I never write, huh? Hey, each ruler costs 50 cents. I forgot to write, is it? Or I don't know, maybe she write. I, I didn't write, so sorry. There? There? You die, die, have the four bed. How come no money for ruler? I don't. He didn't give me the price. For this, but he gave me the price for rulers. Yeah? Don't know what? Time 50 cents. <laughs> Agree or not? Girls and boys. Yeah. Right? So don't know how many pieces, but 50 cents. This one he gave me. Yes? Hey, six dollars must become don't know what time six, 50, 50 cents must be six dollars. Can you see? Or not? Hello? Do you yeah. understand what I'm trying to say? This must be equal to your six dollars. Agree or not? What time, what must be the money spent on the ruler? Agree or not? Must be equal to your six dollars. Ah, Miss Rachel, do you understand this? Alejandro? Yes. Whoever don't understand, say so. So you're asking what is the number of pieces of ruler? Eh? Pieces, I put question mark, where the CD. Lah, huh? So what is the number? So how many rulers did he buy? Asking this question mark, right? Yes, no. This is pieces, huh? Times money, then give money. Yes, no. 
That means, do you understand what I'm saying? This six dollars is actually, if you let me do it, this six dollars is here. This six dollars, huh? This six dollars is here. All this add up three p, two p plus six dollars is equal to twenty eight fifty. Can you can you understand? But before that, I don't have the six dollars. It's only when after finding what's a up and minus ten, only have six dollars. Then I put it. Get it? Hello. Yes. So I put it here. I put it here. So for your understanding, ah, because this six dollars must come from this guy. Can see, ah, all of them then only add up to two eighty. And then, ah, can ah. So if six dollars, then what? How to find the question mark? Six dollars divided by fifty. Exactly. So you do six dollars divided by fifty cent, can? So then I pray that is a nice whole number because rulers cannot be in decimal. You know, I have decimal. Ah, divide by. 50 cents. Pray hard, it come out to be a nice whole number. 12. 12, thank you, Lord. I think that should be the answer. No need to do anything. Okay, yeah? Yeah? All right, so 12 rulers. Okay? This is a hard question, man, because they didn't give you the price. They didn't give you the highlighter, but they need you to be unit time price, then they tell you. Okay, again? Yes. Thanks for joining us. Please give us a thumbs up, share and subscribe. And for more great tips like this, make sure to watch Maths I Can Do.